Hello, my name is Rachel, and I just recently started selling things on Poshmark. Okay, so apparently I'm treating Poshmark like any of my hobbies, where half the fun is buying supplies for the hobby. <laughs> because I did a, a rather small Temu order, and most of this, I don't remember everything I, that I purchased, but most of this is supplies for selling on Poshmark. <laughs> And I, I had to like, I like no makeup or anything because this just showed up. I need what's in here. <laughs> so I thought I would just jump on here and do a, a nice, really super casual, not made up, you know, <laughs> video. Just because I still wanted to share uh, with you guys what I got. Because I know a lot of you also sh uh, sell on Poshmark and Macari and whatever. So some of these items might actually interest you because the price is on them. Of course, because it's Temu. Super good. And I also got two items at uh, the Goodwill, my, my local Goodwill. I found two items there. And I'm going to show you those two because obviously that's not enough items for a thrift haul or anything. But let's start with the Temu items. If I can get into this bag. <clears throat> and <laughs> I almost I almost cut one of the items. I slipped off. I trimmed off some of its packaging trying to get this package open. <laughs> Now, this is not a sponsored video. I actually bought these items myself from Temu. Uh, they have sponsored me in the past, but uh, I don't think I'm going to get another another round of that. So, but I'm still going to buy from them because the prices are great. All right, so what I got first off are just some tissue paper because you always need tissue paper when you're packaging things, when you're selling online. So I did get some tissue paper because it was less than a dollar a pack and the tissue paper at the Dollar Tree is now $1.25 a pack and I think it's also ten, uh, packs of 10. I need to go back to the Dollar Tree though and see and just to compare uh, make sure I'm getting a, a good deal here but I did get some black and some purple uh, and these are the big ones the 20 by 26 because I noticed there's a lot of tissue paper like on Amazon and stuff that's like the size of a sheet of paper. I'm like what's the point in that? <laughs> I guess for small things but I definitely need this size. Um, so <laughs> I don't know when I'm going to get to the dollar store, but let me know. The dollar store, I know they have tissue paper, but is, is theirs a better deal at $1.25? Do they maybe have like 20 sheets <laughs> for only $1.25? Because these were like, I think, 80 cents a piece. Okay. And then I got, these are so cute. They are tiny little thank you stickers. A little bit smaller than, than I was expecting, um, but I'm sure it was listed in the description and I just wasn't paying attention. But it was less than a dollar for these. And they are just adorable. They're little cats that say thank you. So nice little thank you stickers for me to put on my packages uh, when I'm shipping them out. Let's see if I can get this. So the way ha they have it taped, the roll taped shut, you, you do lose a couple of the stickers, <laughs> but that's fine. <laughs> but they, let's see here if we can focus. Look how cute these are. <laughs> but I just thought they were adorable. And another roll, they're the same size. I should, again, I should have paid attention to the sizing because I, I did think these would be bigger stickers, but, oh, focus there you go <laughs> but more cute cats that say thank you and it's the same thing where they have that piece of tape on it that's definitely going to ruin a sticker or two to get it going but I do believe each of these rolls have 500 stickers but I wasted about three getting it open <laughs> but yeah super cute super cute little thank you stickers oh wow well, I bought a whole bunch of stickers apparently like just regular because you guys know when I send stuff to people, I like to include stickers. So I just got some cute sticker packs here. I'm pretty sure I've gotten a couple of these before. Ooh, this one has a label in the way. I gotta open these up. Oh, and I think these are just like witchy kitty type things. They're not all cats, but yeah. So just lots of stickers. So many stickers. This one's adorable. <laughs> okay, and. This last one, this one, I definitely have not gotten this one before. <laughs> I don't recognize these, but these are so cute. They're like little apothecary stickers. I'll show you one more because obviously we don't want to go through the whole stack of 50, <laughs> but those are super cute. So I'm really happy to, to have all these fun stickers. Uh, there's st 
stickers are generally less than two dollars for uh, anywhere from 50 to 100 stickers so good deal on on stickers and i think i already mentioned <laughs> I do like to include a, a little gift baggie with some free stickers and some other things when I um, sell things on my Etsy or my Poshmark or when I have giveaways with you guys. Sometimes I'll include a little extra baggie with some extra stuff. And then the final thing that I did get, <laughs> this is a plastic mason jar lid with a straw hole. I have one of those skull mason jar glasses that I got a couple of years ago around Halloween. They, they, come, they come out every Halloween where, you know, like they have the lid on them and the straw already. But that lid was metal and it rusted out like super quick. <laughs> so I thought I would get a plastic one so I can keep you because I, I love having um, a lid and a straw on my cup because I'm a mess and I'm always knocking things over and, and I don't spill nearly as much and make nearly as big of a mess when it has a lid and a straw. <laughs> So I'm really excited to try this. It looks like a standard, you know, um, mason jar lid. So it should work for my skull cup and I can start using that again because I haven't been using it because the lid rusted out and, and you know, the way they're, they're shaped, it's not comfortable to drink straight out of it. And you can still put a straw in without the lid, but you know, thought I'd give these a try. <laughs> That's everything I got from Temu, and, and it, it wasn't a super large order, just, just some things that I wanted to <laughs> immediately start using. <laughs> so I just, and I, but I still wanted to share with you all. But let me show you the two things I found at Goodwill just today. <laughs> I found this adorable Betsyville tote. This is so cute. Uh, a black shiny vinyl, you know, the purple leopard, cute little Betsyville logo. And Betsyville, of course, is a division of Betsy Johnson. I'm probably going to keep this for myself because this is absolutely adorable. And uh, recently I was looking for a tote through in my collection, but but all, um, I had a couple that were actually smaller than this. And I needed one bigger. <laughs> so this is great. This would be a great like overnight bag for traveling. Absolutely adorable. And it was Goodwill. So I think it was, I think their purses are like $9 at Goodwill. So... But yeah, I was really happy to find that, and this this I'm most likely keeping. Now this is most likely going to end up on my Poshmark because it doesn't fit me. If it fit me, I would be keeping this as well. <laughs> but it's a silver faux fur jacket, and it's reversible. So you can have the silver faux fur on the outside or the inside. And see, it's just black satin but the pockets are all there and the buttons so that you can reverse it and have it either way. So I guess if it were black, then you would just have like the collar, faux collar trim, fur collar trim, because it does have the faux fur on both sides. So, but yeah, super awesome. Just a little bit too tight on me. So it'll probably end up in my Poshmark. Uh, it is by Anne Klein. I don't know if that has any resale value or not. I just thought it was the cutest coat. <laughs> but yeah, if it fit me, this would be mine too. <laughs> but that's that's all I have to share with you guys today. Um, Hopefully this was a short video and somewhat entertaining. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you thought about my Temu purchases as well as my Goodwill finds. <laughs> and if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy the video, of course, you can give it a thumbs down and please tell me all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. And I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.